Hello everyone, I am Brianna and welcome to my channel. Today's video, I am going to be doing a plan with me for the week of the 15th through the 21st. <music> Now I seem to be busy on the weekends these days and my plan day for the week is Monday. Sometimes it goes into Tuesday if I am, you know, extra busy, but today is actually the 15th and I, so I finished up this last week, the 8th through the 14th. I loved this spread. I loved how it turned out. Um, I just thought it was really cute. I have an idea for this current week, and I'm not sure how it's going to go, but I have some things out. So I have my sticker book from Amazon, and this is all of the Planet Perfect stickers that I haven't used, so kind of a collection of them. So I'm gonna use Planet Perfect stickers and Planet Perfect washi. So these are from previous boxes, previous years. I even think this is last year. I am not sure about this girl. Was she last month or was this last year as well? I can't remember. Um, but I'm like, okay, can I use these two together somehow? You know, the sun and some of these stickers, they seem to go like look at the palm tree and the coconut and stuff like that. So I'm going to try to create something using what I have from Planner Perfect. I know that, um, I don't think I really do that often. I have a lot of hand can plan kits. I have, um, like last week, it, these were stickers that um, Taylor from Tailored Plan sent me and their London gifties. Um, this one was Planner Perfect because it was the 4th of July and I was like, okay, this one could work. But I have a lot of Coco Daisy items that I use. And so um, when I can use my Planner Perfect on a spread, I like it because then I'm using up what I have because I have a collection of stickers that, I mean, it's still, it's growing because I am still subscribed to the sub box and um, is subscribed even the right word. I still, I don't know, I still get the sub box and each month you get new stickers. So um, I'm gonna keep getting stickers. And my thought right now is just use up what I have. Use, use, use. Like for this monthly plan book, I have been just using stickers like for the week. They're Coco Daisy stickers, but I'm like, you know what? I just, I'm gonna use what makes me happy and I'm gonna put it down and um, use what I have so that I don't have leftovers. So I actually, just slipping through, I saw this. Um, have you seen, it's Carol and Taylor. Um, they have a Facebook page. I will try to link that actually in the description, but last month they did a summer bucket list. So the, this page is self care. And then this page, I printed it wrong, you guys. So this page was the summer bucket list. I was actually going to tip this in, but since I printed it kind of funny, I went over to my goal pages and wrote out some of the things that I wanna do in the summer with the kids. Um, so these are my goal pages. I guess we're not gonna set up right away, which that usually happens. I kind of get in like a chatty mood and show you all the things. So I have school goals, um, my director role, and then my homeschool goals for this month. Um, summer bucket list, things that I wanna do before school starts. Um, maybe they might not all happen in July, hoping they will because August is gonna be kind of busy with all the back to school things um, since I'm gonna be the you know director and and stuff. So actually, you know what? My daughter's birthday, she's going to be six and I'm just trying to finalize details. I thought she wanted to go to the roller rink, but apparently she changed it to wanting to go to the beach, 
which actually might be easier because that's closer to us than a roller rink. Um, so I need to start writing down details of that. Um, personal goals and then on the weekly spread, I put my gratitude and then on the daily pages, I write my verse and maybe a little journaling or um, Bible study notes. So that's how I've been using this plan book. Um, anyway, so yeah, go check out Carol and Taylor on their Facebook page and print out this fun bucket list. Okay, now let's see here. This book hasn't changed. It's my yearly planner for my um, classical conversations stuff. I haven't really filled out a lot in here. My plan though this week is to get a lot done. And so I need to list out supplies that I need for the first six weeks. Um, tomorrow with it being prime day or the start of prime day, I think it's tomorrow. Uh, I want to really, you know, scour Amazon and see what deals I can come up with because there are a lot of supplies that I need to get for like science projects and art projects and things like that. Um, and then I just write notes and then I just need to figure out what I need to use these pages for. Um, they're beautiful. I love these stickers, um, but I need to figure out what I need to keep track of. So that is a work in progress. And then this one is just gonna be notes, my director notes. And this will last me all year um, because I'm not gonna have a ton. So these two books, which if you've watched my videos before, you know, these two books are going to stay in my TN all year long. Um, it, they are summer theme, but I feel like the lighthouse and the sailboat, like they kind of go good with school themes. Um, and I don't know, looking ahead, I just really like having these in my TN. And then of course I have something that is fall and it's July, but I don't care. I love the fall and I love this girl. And so this is my six month planner. I'm going to have her on here until um, I get a new one that st will start in January. Um, but this just brings me so much joy. I feel like if I could have fall all year round in my TN, I, I don't think I'd be mad about that. Um, but I think that you know, you probably know that about me. <laughs> okay, um, so how has your July been going? I feel like I am just, I keep telling my friends, like I am in denial that summer is just zipping on by. I feel like it has gone by so fast and August is going to be here before we know it. And I don't know. I feel like I just need to really get plans down for school next year. Um, you know, start planning everything. I have kind of been playing in my, so I'm just putting washi down. I'm not sure if this is how it's going to stay. Sometimes I like to like switch things around, but um, let me roll my cart over here. I have that three tiered cart and I organized it yesterday because um, it was getting out of control. You know, sometimes you just like, throw things you just like throw it over there or throw it in and um then things get unorganized so I really it needed help okay so the 15th see I don't think this is really the right color to use oops oh well and 21 um I haven't really picked out any colors yet that I wanted to use. And I always forget that I have these and they are just like the perfect colors. So I probably would have used one of these before my dates, but maybe I can use them to write in some things. Uh, so anyways, I have been playing around with my 
Erin Condren monthly and filling in some things. And I haven't decided if I want that to be more like functional or if I want to decorate it as well. I feel like I might just leave it functional and not worry about decorating mainly because it takes pressure off of me and uh, let's see if I can talk and figure out what I'm doing. <laughs> it takes pressure off of me to not have to sit and decorate. I can just, you know, open it and plan for the school and it's probably better that way because I put so much effort into decorating this TN that, and my Hobonichi that I think it's enough. Um, I'm writing the weather. So what I do is I take like the Planner Perfect pad of paper and I just write down the weather for the week. And then I just copy it. Or So last night, you guys, I didn't get to bed till like midnight, so I'm kind of tired, um, but I did get to sleep in, so that's good. We celebrated a friend. We went, um, did a scavenger hunt for her, um, and then we went out to dinner, and it was just such a great night. Like, it was so much fun, um, but I am definitely tired. Okay, so I think I want pineapples. I'm not really feeling this washi right now. Um, I think I'm going to take it off. Let's see. And figure out what I need to do. So I just love this girl and then all of these greens. Like with the palm tree and the pineapple. and So I don't know if I'm going to... I wonder if I could put more... Hmm... So I wrote the date, so do I want her to go down or is that too much? Like, do I, do I put more of her anywhere? Or do I just decorate with stickers? Because there is this one right here, let me grab it, that I absolutely love. Like I, I think this is my favorite beachy, like summer girl. Um, and I'll tell you why, mainly because you can't see the bottom half of her. Um, one thing that I don't really like is that these bathing suits are a little bit too skimpy. Um, and so with her, I really like that, um, you know, it covers her bottom half. I'm like trying to see if I have any other ones. Um, yeah, it's just too, I don't know. That's the style right now, but... I don't like that style. Let's see. It's so hit and miss with like peeling up washi and stickers from this paper that I never know if it's going to rip or not. But I'm thankful that that one was easy. I want her down there. Now the palm tree. Do I want to, do I want to move the pineapple? I just started sticking. And sometimes I to put that there. The pineapple. Hmm. Let's see. So sometimes I like to write all of my things first, but now I have come to realize that I need to decorate first because then I start putting stickers over what I've written. Um, so you know what I'm gonna do? I'm kind of having a hard time figuring out what I want to do while trying to talk to you. Um, so I'm going to put you on fast mode and then we can chat when I'm finished.
Okay, I think I'm done for this week. I actually like how it turned out. I think it's super cute. Um, I just, you know, pulled different stickers from Planner Perfect and I'm kind of in love with how it turned out. I used a brown, like this color mild liner for like the main things. And then I used this mild liner to like highlight the arrows. Like there are no names on that. And then to write the D for dinner, I used um, this green from the pack that I have here. So I am also super excited. I placed an Erin Condren order recently and it had, actually while I talk, I'm just gonna set up um, this week here. So I purchased that like caboodle looking thing, the pink um, like tackle box type thing. And I just like, sorry, I forgot exactly what it was called. But um, I ordered that for all of my London gifties tapes. I figure I will need, I don't know, I just need another storage system for that because what I am using now, it's kind of, it's too small and it's not really working. And I just recently placed another order with London gifties and so, I'm gonna be getting more rolls of those tapes and so I need to have room. So I'm hoping that that will actually work for um, like fitting all of the things that I want to fit in there. Now, um, how did I do this one? Turn this side. Okay, so I also placed an order because I was talking to Carol over at mom.plans over the weekend and she was telling me like how much she loved the acrylic pen organizer that came out from the back to school launch. I think it was the back to school launch. Um, anyways, she was telling me about it and she totally sold me on it. So I went ahead and purchased two of those because I guess I should show you my cart, how it looks right now and like what I'm thinking because I just need a better system than what I have and I feel like I have too many pens right now and I need to be organized and um, with all of those different compartments on the one from Erin Condren it just seems like it would be ideal so let me finish putting this down and then I'll turn you around to show you what I'm talking about. Okay, and I think I'm just gonna do half for Saturday and Sunday. And then I'll turn it around on this end. And do half, okay. So let me turn you around really quick. Okay, so here's my cart. I know I've shown this before, but this is what it currently looks like. Um, so this doesn't stay here. My goal is to, I want to have some of my washi up here. So I don't understand, I'm like, I don't really know how the drawer system would fit on a cart. So I need to figure that out. But I do have this drawer that I took out um, it's my summer washi and I will probably put this back and then bring out my fall one that I have um, when it becomes fall. But in here, that's where I keep all of my London gifties things and I need something bigger. So down here I keep like the Coco Daisy kit that I am going to be using next month. I have all of my like stickers here. Um, so then what I really need to organize is like, is this bin here? I kind of want to eliminate this bin and eliminate these two things that are in here and have all these pens be in those organizers. I'm not sure if they'll all fit, but I'm hoping. Um, so we'll see how that works. 
And then I just have my Erin Condren 12 month planner and my Bible study and then three different Bible translations. This one's actually fun because it's a chronological study Bible. And I have been like, I want to read this from cover to cover. So I'm in Genesis right now because I just started. Um, but then I have the NASB and then the ESV Bible translation so that I can look those up if I need to. So this is my cart. Um, I just want to get it a little bit more organized. You know, it works, but I want it to be a little bit better. Okay. Well, I hope that you liked seeing that and it wasn't like you didn't feel like it was a waste. I am actually going to write out my days. I find that I need to have him written out. Okay, that's a really good color and that goes perfectly with that washi. I might actually use this one to highlight the days of the week over on my six month agenda. We'll see how that looks. Um, so having everything prepped has really helped me um, because I don't have time to do it every single day. Okay. And then I think I'm gonna put Saturday down here. Can you see that? Nope, there you go. Saturday and Sunday. Okay, um, so I was filming this and then I had to pause it. We had to take all of our rugs from downstairs out of the house. Um, we didn't do any upstairs because we could close the doors. Oh, see what I get for talking? I missed the S. Okay, so um, our puppy is one of them um, is just destroying it, like just chewing it up. Um, so we're like, okay, we need to get this out of here so that, you know, it's usable once he's done with this phase. Um, and then, you know, he has accidents on them. And like, if he's gonna have an accident, I would rather him have an accident on our tile or on the wood than on a wool rug. Um, so I just didn't want to deal with it anymore. But anyway, so I had to um, pause and help my husband get those into a trailer. And he's going to put them in our little storage container at the ranch. And that is like completely sealed. So mice or rodents or anything can't get in it um, and then destroy them further. <laughs> to put this one over here 13 but our house looks so different now because it doesn't have all of the the rugs and then like the echoes coming back <laughs> um so I can't wait till he is done with the chewing phase and we can get our rugs back Okay, I'm just trying to think. I'm, I wrote rest day over here and then look at all the things that I'm like doing. So um, I'm just gonna add that. Remove rugs. <clears throat> Even though I already did it, oops. I'm still gonna write it on there so that it's, you know, that's what I did. Okay, let's see, I'm going for it, you guys. Hopefully it will add some color to my pages. Okay. Um, I also had to add this washi down the side here because I don't know, it didn't have enough washi on the page. Like I needed, I needed something else and I just, I love how it turned out. I really like it. So you know what else I need to do 
tonight while I'm making dinner, I need to prep. I'm bringing a salad to a party tomorrow and so I need to prep that. Um, for tomorrow. I wanna cut the lettuce, make the croutons, make the Caesar dressing, make the chicken, and then all I'll have to do is just pull everything out of the fridge and put it together and toss it. Cause I have an, a dentist appointment in the morning, so I'm not gonna have time to do stuff. Um, all right, I think this is it, you guys. I am so glad that you joined me today. I um, appreciate you. I appreciate that you are here and you're supporting me and you're chatting with me. Uh, it is just so fun. This, you know, planner community is just so amazing. Uh, you know, you make some great friends and acquaintances and you have good conversations and it's just, I am so glad that, was it two years ago? I don't know, that I turned on the camera and was like, I'm going to film an unboxing. And I think it was an Erin Condren unboxing. Um, and that's when I started doing planning stuff because I thought I was gonna do homeschool things, but it just turned into this and I absolutely love it. So anyways, I will see you guys on my next video. I hope that you have a wonderful week and, um, you know, enjoy your summer. I hope that you're having, you know, a great time with any trips or just pool days or beach days or whatever you're up to. Um, but yeah, we'll talk soon. Bye you guys. Mm -hmm.